Welcome to your step-by-step -step uninstallation guide. In this video tutorial, we'll show you the proper way to remove QGIS, R, and RStudio from your computer so you can install fresh, clean copies with ease. Keep watching and let's reboot your experience together. There are several reasons why you might want to completely remove QGIS, R, and RStudio from your computer to install new, clean versions. Here are three possible reasons applicable to these three programs. 1. Version updates. Over time, QGIS, R, and RStudio undergo updates that include improvements in functionality, bug fixes, performance enhancements, and new features. By removing and installing new, clean versions of these programs, you ensure access to all the latest improvements and features. Avoiding potential conflicts and compatibility issues that may arise if you use older versions of the programs. 2. Solving errors and technical issues. If you have encountered errors, crashes, or persistent technical issues with your current installation of QGIS, R, or RStudio, completely removing the applications and their associated files can be an effective way to resolve these problems. A new, clean installation ensures that there are no corrupted files or incorrect settings that may be causing issues in the programs. 3. System Cleanup and Optimization Software installations can accumulate temporary files, outdated configurations, and other unnecessary data that can affect program performance and consume disk space. By completely removing QGIS, R, and RStudio and installing new, clean versions, you could improve the performance of the applications by eliminating these outdated or unnecessary files and configurations and freeing up space on your computer. It is important to note that by completely removing these programs, you could also lose some data and customized settings. Therefore, it is recommended to back up your projects, scripts, packages, and settings before proceeding with the uninstallation and new installation. How to completely remove QGIS, a step-by-step -step guide. 1. Close QGIS. Before uninstalling, make sure QGIS is not running. Close the application if it's open. 2. Windows Users A. Open the Control Panel, search for Control Panel in the Search Toolbar, then select Control Panel. B. Navigate to Programs and Features. Under the Control Panel, click on Uninstall a Program or Programs and Features. C. Locate QGIS. Scroll through the list of installed programs to find QGIS. D. Uninstall QGIS. Right-click on QGIS, then select Uninstall. Follow the prompts to remove the software. 3. Remove residual files. To ensure a thorough removal, you may want to delete any remaining QGIS-related files and folders. Look for any remaining files and folders in the following locations. And remove any folder related to QGIS. It is very important to check the hidden folders. To make the folders visible, select File, click on Change Folder and Search Options, select the View tab, make sure you mark Show Hidden Files, Folders, and Drivers, then click Apply and OK. Now, the next step is to remove the folders from the previously hidden app data folder. To do this, you need to navigate to the following locations. Then, remove the QGIS folders from these directories. After completing this process, QGIS will be completely removed. How to completely remove R, a step-by-step -step guide. The steps to completely remove R are quite similar to those followed for uninstalling QGIS. Let's take a closer look at these steps in detail. 1. Go to the control panel. 2. Select uninstall a program under programs. 3. Find R for Windows in the list of programs. 4. Right-click and choose Uninstall. Follow the prompts to complete the uninstallation process. 5. Once you have uninstalled R, there may be some associated files and folders left on your computer. To remove them, open File Explorer and navigate to the following folders and delete them.
The next step is to delete the R folders in the hidden app data folder. Remember, we previously explained how to make these folders visible. Six, if you also want to remove any related environment variables for R, follow these steps. Right-click on the This PC icon and select Properties. Click on Advanced System Settings in the left panel. In the Advanced tab, click the Environment Variables button. In the User Variables or System Variables section, look for any R-related variables and remove them. Click OK to close the Environment Variables and System Properties windows. 7. Finally, restart your computer to ensure all changes have been applied correctly. By following these steps, you should have completely removed the R program and all its associated files from your Windows computer. How to completely remove RStudio, a step-by-step -step guide. To remove RStudio, we are going to follow these steps. 1. Go to the Control Panel. 2. Select Uninstall a program under Programs. 3. Find RStudio in the list of programs. 4. Right-click and choose Uninstall. Follow the prompts to complete the uninstallation process. Once you have uninstalled RStudio, there may be some associated files and folders left on your computer. To remove them, follow these steps. 5. Open File Explorer and navigate to the following folders and delete them. Sometimes there is nothing to remove from them, but it's important to check nonetheless. Lastly, remove the RStudio folders from the hidden app data folder. Six, empty the recycle bin and restart the PC to ensure all changes are applied correctly. Now that you have completed a full uninstallation of QGIS, R, and RStudio, you can install the most up-to-date versions of them as completely clean software. Go to the GeoRGB community website at geesecourse.online and select the Resources tab. From here, you can install all the software from the main websites.